everybody, Cindy A. Lewis here, and I am traveling, as most of you watch my channel know, that we had a quick weekend down to Texas, and I always bring a craft bag with me. Now, I don't always have time to do a lot of crafts, but I never want to be without my something possibly to work on. So I thought today I would do a what's in my bag, what's in my craft bag video. And I thought you might be curious to see what did I take with me on this trip. So that's what this video is gonna be. It is going up today, which is July 30th. So I just wanna remind you, you have one more day to enter because tomorrow is the drawing for the July 31st Christmas in July giveaway. So anyway, let's see what's in this bag. We're actually at our uncle's house. He is so hospitable to allow us to stay here. So we usually get this room. It's a nice bedroom, big, and a nice queen size bed, which is what I'll be showing this on. So this is my go bag for this trip. This is my all-in-one uh, We Are Memory Keepers bag, so I just thought I would use this. So you can see I've packed it pretty full, and I have a bag. So you can see what's in here. <laughs> then I brought papers. So some papers were already in here. You can see I'm just pulling out whatever's in here. You can see what's in here. And some things were just in here. So I do have some scraps. So just some regular <laughs> scraps. So there you go. I just want to make sure you can see everything all right. All right, so I have some cute stickers. These are actually from Hobby Lobby, so really cute Christmas stickers. Maybe I should put those in that little plastic bag. Some other scraps, some white and black paper, some uh, the Buffalo check in black and white, and some little pearl, um, Centura pearl, I think, pink. Then I brought some Christmas papers because there is a project that I want to work on. And so I brought this fireside paper. These are used pads that have uh, a lot already out of them. This one is a bow bunny paper. Then I did bring this red and black Buffalo check paper collection. I have found that these have a finish on the other side. So it's interesting because it feels almost like plastic. Or, I don't know, that finish is different. I have some of my cr traditional Christmas papers. This is from the Crafters Companion Paper Library. Really cute papers. And then have a Merry Christmas Echo Park. I love these papers. A lot of them are very vintage. And one thing that I will tell you I wanted to work on is my master boards for my Christmas planner. So some of you know about that. And so that's all that was in this pocket. Let's go to the front pocket and see what's in here. Now, this is a really nice bag, by the way. All right, so I do have some tools here, my awl, some thread. Um, this is a, one of those scrapers. This is all my little tools for my Cricut. Some little bows are in here. And then needles. And this is for doing journals. So I do have that. So in the pockets, look how organized this is. <laughs> I have some ta a tape runner. I have a pen. I have a paintbrush. Uh, some scissors, and what is this? A pair of tweezers. All right, that could actually fit in this pocket here. I have a rock block, some ribbon, and some kalal glue. Of course I do. And what else is in here? Some vintage washi. And then there's another pocket here, if you can see very good, and that's my remote. This is the this is what I try to use. <laughs> they don't always work the best. So, oh, and look at that. I have another blade. Yay! Hondo ate one. Do you remember that? Uh -huh. Okay, that's good to know. That's in there. It was in the dark. All right, let's see what's in this pocket here. 
So we're gonna see, this opens all the way up, so it's really nice the way that it opens. So here's my instruction, ooh, there's a box lid. <laughs> here's my instructions for my all-in-one, along with a stamping platform, which is really nice. I have my storage container. This one has a crack in it, so I do need to replace it. But it's probably because I'm cramming all kinds of stuff in there. And we can take a look in there in just a minute. All right, I have some cards, envelopes, and some cards I think are in here. Some file folders for my master board. Here's some scraps, a little bit of scraps. A Santa picture. Oh, these must have fallen out. Those are some tickets. Then here's my all-in-one. Yay. And then my chargers for my phone and my uh, iPad. Some more scraps. And then here's my some ephemera or stickers. This is some flower ones. Nothing in these pockets here. And then what is in here this little container i've got my waterproof black nor black ink pad and my vintage photo distress oxide which is my favorite some stamps christmas some decoupage pages with these vintage santas which are amazing some more stamps some stickers some of these fun Santa, vintage Santa papers that I got from Timu. Some fun stickers. This little packet that I got from Timu with all kinds of Christmas goodies and some twine. More, all of these are all stickers. These are tags. These are super cute. And I've got my embossing, I mean my blending tool and then there's just more stickers in here some ribbon a glassine bag just a napkin yeah and that's what's in my go bag today so that's what i did to take on my trip i have a planned project i just don't know if i'll get to it anyway thanks so much for watching me open my bag and see what's in it for my trip. Have a great day and hope you get a lot of projects done.